Hey there guys, it's Slash one here, uh, back with another shout out, Sunday, Sunday, Sunday! Um, basically, if you've never seen this before, which you might not have, because I haven't done one in a couple of months, um, it's uh, basically just a shouting out to the awesome people subscribed on the channel here for supporting it. Uh, just a little bit of love for me to you, to give you uh, basically just some appreciation, because... Uh, you, you know, you guys are why I make these videos, sort of, you know, I like making them for fun too. But you know, it gives me some satisfaction for it. Um, basically, um, yeah, this special, this one's going to be a special Shout Out Sunday because of the fact that it's going to be a giveaway video as well. Um, so similar to the other giveaways I've done on the channel, um, nothing really, I mean, it's, it's, I feel like it's a little bit better than the other giveaways. Um, nothing too spectacular though, I'm still poor up of to start paying my student debts off next month which is literally two days away so um that's gonna be fun so i don't i you know i'm not giving away you know the whole kitchen sink and everything like that but you know it's just something free for for some awesome people out there um so anyways uh before i get to all of the details on that and some shout outs to some awesome things that happened over the past little bit um we're gonna do it like we always do shouting out to some awesome people um so let's get right into it before i do as always apologies for getting some names wrong because i'm going to i know i am um but yeah let's start this off starting off shout outs to kiwi bandicoot to bison there's a nice picture of a charging bison on there ivan toner marilyn myers um boss man 1974 x seb lefebvre girl x um killer drum seven glenn fossum uh, Yvette Roach, Lowe's, Laws, uh, Jordan, uh, Fitzmaurice, The Man O'Manny, Daniel Axmacher, um, Alan Ramirez, 100, John O'Halloran, K. Walt, Edvin Leckberg, uh, Zandau Plasas, um, Scarlett, uh, Henrique Komura, uh, Hashtag J. Rocks, and last but not least, Olivier Leplou. Um, I'm gonna guess it's it's kind of, uh, you know, European, French, I don't know. But anyways, thank you all for subscribing to the channel. Um, uh, must mean that you like something about something on this. Um, hopefully something that I've done, I don't know. That or you accidentally click the button, who knows. Uh, but thank you all, uh, sincerely for, um, supporting it. It, it really does mean a lot to me. It's a nice, uh... It's nice to see people enjoying some of the stuff that I make, even though I know some of it may or may not be the best, but that's okay. Um, anyways, let's get right into some other fun stuff. Um, Shoutouts to the fact that it's uh, it's Halloween tomorrow, which is fun. Um, I, I enjoy Halloween, at least as far as the whole atmosphere and stuff. Lots of cool stuff has happened since um, the last Shoutout Sundays, but uh, Halloween tomorrow, like I said, it's fun stuff. Um, I don't think I'm personally really going to be doing anything because I have to work. Till, till night time, uh, so not much time to really do much um, tomorrow, but you know, who knows, I'll probably dress up for, for a little bit for Halloween, I still don't really know what to dress up as quite yet, uh, I have a couple of easy ideas that I've done in the past, um, which I still don't know what to do, but if you see this video before tomorrow, comment below, I have a couple choices, my go-to, like my easy go-tos usually are Team Rocket Grunt, because I already have a costume for that, or I've done Glenn from Walking Dead in the past as well. Um, trying to think of what else. I don't know. There's there's a few Travis touchdown from from uh from uh I'm blanking on no more heroes. Um, I don't know. There's a couple ideas there, but you can think of other easy ideas that I could potentially go as um you know to work tomorrow. I get to dress up if I want to, but yeah, you know, we'll see. We'll see. I don't know. Just some ideas. Out, throw some ideas out there if you see this before then or even afterwards. Maybe I'll use them for future ideas. Um, but yeah, Halloween small. Shout out to that. That's fun stuff. Hopefully you're going to be doing something fun um, for Halloween. Um, otherwise, uh, other fun stuff that's happened. Um, Halloween events have been going on. I know a lot. Not a lot of people have been on the Pokemon Go hype train anymore. It's very petering off. Uh, I myself haven't really touched it all too much, although I, I, I turn it on every once in a while, see if anything cools around. They're doing their Halloween events, basically just means more ghosties and uh, Cubones, and for some reason a lot of Meowths are popping up. So, I mean, better than the Pidgeys and, and Rattatas that just pop up everywhere, so that's that's some fun stuff. Um, otherwise, more Halloween events as well. Um, stuff like Overwatch uh, had their Halloween events, um, did a couple of uh, loot unboxing things. Uh, very cool, cool loot. I love Blizzard's uh, 
take or not take, but I like their I like their seasonal events. It's fun stuff. So I can't wait to see what they do for uh for like the holiday season. Um so that was fun. Um trying to think of what else has, has been going on since since the last time around. There's lots of stuff that's cool. Actually, two other things I wanted to uh put to. I know this video is gonna probably get long because I got a lot of back backlog to, to talk about. Actually, one thing I want to backlog to, I did a Shadowed Sunday video. I recorded one in September because I, I feel like at this point it's going to be a monthly thing. Um, and I just never got around to uploading it, so I, this is kind of replacing it instead of uploading that one. Um, if Shadows to Fan Expo, I'll, I'll probably redo a video for that uh, just because I still want to show some of the stuff or talk about Fan Expo because it was a fun time. Uh, I got to meet Kevin Smith, which actually wearing uh, jersey and it's got signed on top of there, which is cool. Um, but yeah, um, Fan Expo was super fun. Got to meet lots of uh, cool people and meet up with some friends and whatnot. So that was fun times. Um, got to meet Mark Hamill and Kevin Smith and a bunch of others. So that was uh, super awesome as always. So so good times, good times at Fan Expo. Um, otherwise, two other things I wanted to shout out to, uh, just because they're actually ending tomorrow. So hopefully you'll get to see this before then. Um, two Kickstarter campaigns I really wanted to talk about real quickly because, the like I said, they're they're gonna be closing out um, October thirty first. Uh, Pretending to grown up, um, it's a Kickstarter campaign from Jason Anarchy's done the uh, Drinking Quest games as well as I think Haiku Warriors and a couple others. Um, he's got a new game coming out with um, the uh, the artist for Doodle for Food, Megan McKay. Love the web comic there, um, fun, playful art style. So it's a card game coming out. Looks super awesome. It's a as their as their quick little tagline. It's a casual card game for grown-ups to feel like they're pretending. It's got a Unipegasaurus on there. It's super adorable. Um, and plus a bunch of awesome uh, guest artists for cards that uh, got smashed through from their stretch goals. Most notably, um, I guess more recently, Cyanide and Happiness is going to be creating a card in there as well. So go check that out before it ends because you can get some cool stuff. And one of their more fun reward tiers, which I think there's still a couple spots left. There's one spot open in one of them right now um, as of this recording. It's probably going to get filled up before I do. But the Power of Imagination pack basically uh, gets you a signed card. Or not a signed card, but it has a has a compliment on one from Megan and an uh, insult on the other from Jason. He did it for Drinking Quest um, last time around, and it was, it was fun stuff. And also... Um, just speaking of Drinking Quest, I finally got to play it with some friends uh, last night, two nights ago, um, and it was super awesome as always, fun, fun times. Um, and uh, I got to meet Jason at uh, Fan Expo actually, so that was another thing I'll probably get into on the Fan Expo video, but uh, really awesome guy, and he, he did the insults and stuff right on the spot, so... Um, anyways, that's that's one campaign there that I really want to talk about. The other one is Steve Lichman, which let me just quickly grab this off my bookshelf here. There we go. Steve Lichman, Volume 2 is on Kickstarter. It's going to be ending uh, tomorrow, like I said. Um, and this is the Volume 1 um, book. It's very beautiful. It's one of the nicest things on my bookshelf. Plus, it's a really awesome read. I loved it. Um, so anyways, yeah, they're they're going to be uh, ending soon. They're going to have a PayPal store, I think, from what they mentioned on their um, latest update. So just in case you don't get around to it before then, get it on, uh, you can pre-order on PayPal and, and whatnot. So that's going to be cool. But uh, yeah, Volume 2 is out. There's going to be, there's a preview on their Kickstarter page as well. So if you want to give a, a little bit of a read, um, go do that because it's it's a, it's a it's fun times. Um, but yeah, otherwise... Uh, I don't know, go check out Steve Lichman, because it was one of my favorite campaigns. The one thing that I wish was a little lower, their international shipping is a tad high, unfortunately, but I'll still back it anyways, because it was, like I said, one of my favorite reads, um, you know, more recently anyways, and, and look how beautiful it is. Look how beautiful it is. You can also pick up Volume 1 as well, so, so you can get this, and then Volume 2 is going to have Dracula, and it's going to be nice red cloth bound with the shiny gold embossing and everything like that. So that's super rad. Um, so yeah, there's that. And I think that's all I really wanted to get out as far as the initial shout-out stuff. I can't really think of anything else that's been going on more recently around here. Um, lots of fun video games coming out. Pokemon Sun and Moon I'm excited for. And Final Fantasy XV finally, finally coming out. Um, and, you know, lots of other games come out. But one game that's come out uh, this past month is Gears of War 4. That, I'm not giving away a copy of Gears of War 4, but I am giving something Gears of War related. 
Um, like last time around, we're going to be giving away some video games. Now this time around, I think what I'm going to be doing is just one grand prize winner as opposed to separate prizes um, like before. Just because in, in Gears of War 4, or at least in the game, um, the disc, the box, the packaging, whatever, there's codes on the back of this little card here. For the four previous games, um, basically a digital code for them on 360, but you can use them on Xbox One, so if you have one of the two consoles, you get some chance to win, to play some of the previous Gears of War games, um, and yeah, that's basically this, so this is the giveaway video, um, so you have to go through 10 minutes worth of other stuff, I'll, I'll maybe let you skip through it, I'll, I'll put a link or one of those timestamps or whatever so you can skip ahead if you don't feel like listening to the rest of it, but if you made it all the way through this already, good job! Um, but yeah, basically, um, the uh, the giveaway, it's gonna work for, like the other ones I've done, basically just be subscribed to the channel, so if you haven't already, just click that subscribe button down below, it's that little red subscribe button, it's pretty easy, so click that, um, otherwise, like the video, it's that little thumbs up somewhere down there. Um, and, uh, basically, give a comment. Now, I'm gonna do something more specific just to make sure you're paying attention. Um, just cause it's essentially video game season. Uh, November is, is the big year of, or month of video games. Um, tell me what your favorite video game of all time is. I'd like to know a little bit more about you guys. Um, so, so just in the comment section down below, give a comment and say, you know, whatever, and then once you do those three things, click some buttons, type some stuff, you're entered to win, and then, you know, I'll be doing another video probably sometime at the end of November or so, um, to draw whoever wins some of these games. Um, now, actually, the other thing I wanted to ask as well is, depending on what people prefer, so like I said, it's going to be either one grand prize winner, I also thought about, just because there's actually four separate codes for Gears of War 1, 2, 3, and Judgment, um, basically if, if you want to do four separate winners, so each person just gets one game, or if one person gets all four games, um, I guess majority wins, uh, so, so put that in the comment if you have a, an opinion on that, but for the time being it's going to be one one winner takes all. Um, but yeah, otherwise, like I said, that's that's really all to it. Just uh, subscribe, like, and then just comment somewhere on the video just saying what your favorite video game is. If you don't have a favorite video game, uh, you know what, Halloween's tomorrow. Tell, tell me tell me what you're going to be doing for Halloween or what your costume is or whatever. Just just something Halloween related or something video game related. That's it's pretty easy. You got lots of lots of free reign with that. Um, and that's that's all to it. That's about it. Um, so I'll end this video. It's getting a little long. I know I sat 13 minutes just to, to learn about that. Um, but uh, yeah, good luck um, for anybody. Now one other thing, actually before I do uh, go, just one other rule as far as the winner. Um, just because the Xbox One, the Xbox One itself isn't region locked anymore, but their their stores are. So just because it is a digital game, unfortunately it is North America only. Um, so um, I, I apologize for any international viewers. Um, but if you win, but you're not from North America, I will figure something else out for you. I have additional Steam random games that I can figure out. So if you, that or you know what, I know people get around it by, you know, setting up a US account or whatever, but uh, if you don't want to go through all that, if, if you end up winning and you can't actually redeem these codes, uh, when I message you, if you win, um, just uh, we'll figure something else out. I'll give you some Steam games or something like that. Um, I don't know, we'll see. We'll figure something out from there, but otherwise, um, yeah, that's, that's, all, that's all I gotta say. Thanks for watching, guys, as always. Again, thank you to all the new subscribers and, and anybody else that's watching and past subscribers as well, uh, current subscribers, whatever. Um, and, uh, yeah, like I said, have a happy, happy holiday Halloween. Um, and probably since I won't get around to it, but uh, happy Thanksgiving for uh, those down south from me uh, in the States. Um, you know, you got election time coming up too, so good luck with that as well. Um, but yeah, otherwise, uh, so good stuff, good stuff. I'm gonna, I'm gonna peace out now. Um, thanks as always for watching, guys, and have an awesome day. Till the next one, peace out. I totally forgot to to say one thing just because this happened. This literally happened last night. Worlds. Um, I wanted to shout out to Worlds real quick because because uh, it was it was real epic. Um, I I missed the first game and a half. 
of uh, worlds, but uh, damn, that was that was hype. Um, so uh, I'm referring to League of Legends. Um, uh, it's SKT versus Samsung Galaxy. It was it was not it was in a stomp, which was great. Uh, I mean, the first the, the I heard the first uh, game or so was was pretty bad. But anyways, SKT hype train choo choo um, got it done. Um, so. Three-time world champions, SKT, Faker, Bangi, um, Kuko. Um, very, very exciting. Very exciting stuff. So, anyways, uh, yeah, I just wanted to say that. Congrats, SKT, for the big win, and thanks for the exciting finals. It, I was really hoping, actually, that it wasn't going to be a 3-0 stomp. So, um, good on Samsung Galaxy, actually, for, for making the game super hype. Uh, especially that super long 70-minute game. Um, that was that was sick. Anyways, so yeah, I just want to throw that in because I, I think I, I, I forgot about it. So, so yeah, anyways, see you again, guys. Peace out. Choo-choo. Yeah.